Welcome back to KV News at 10. The Austin Animal Center cannot take in any more dogs. Starting tomorrow, the city run shelter is restricting intakes and only taking in animals in emergencies. Now they need to get at least 60 dogs adopted out or into foster homes to make room for more. If not enough are adopted, shelter staff members tell KVU's Mike Maruth they may have to reconsider their no kill status. The Austin Animal Center has too many dogs. So we, have, we have several employees that have worked here for decades and everyone agrees that this is the worst we've ever seen it. So many dogs, <laughs> the staff fills their office, a storage container, some still waiting to be named, others just having given birth this past weekend, even putting dogs in crates in their commercial loading area. This is the not so great part. 60 dogs sit out here, mostly strays, waiting to be brought inside if and when there's room. We're not doing intakes moving forward until we can get out of crates. So we're only going to take in emergency cases. The Austin Animal Center won't accept healthy dogs or strays unless they're sick or injured. Volunteers and staff need help. It's heartbreaking. A lot of us cry most days um, because we have pets at home too. And like me imagining my pet here, it's heartbreaking. The municipal shelter operates as a no kill center, one of the biggest city owned no kill shelters in the country. An adoption event this weekend, a last hope before a last resort to make space. This is the, the, the Hail Mary before we even get to that discussion. So last month we had a 97.6% outcome rate, which is well above the 95% mandate. Um, but if we can't get these dogs out of here, even with closing intake, then we need to figure out what do we value as a community. The city would have to sign off on any change to the shelter's no kill status, but with limited capacity, staff say nothing is off the table. We have to figure something out as a community. We can't do this alone as a shelter. In Austin, I'm Mike Murray. Mike, thanks a lot. This weekend's adoption event will be at the Austin Animal Center in Southeast Austin. Shelter staff members say they'll bring animals out onto the front lawn there. They'll have a foster matchmaking service available to help dogs that have been at the shelter for a long time find homes. The overcrowding issues aren't just happening at the Austin Animal Center. It's also affecting other shelters in our area. The Williamson County Regional Animal Shelter says it took in 50 animals on Friday alone. And on Saturday, Austin Pets Alive posted that 24 puppies were ready to move out of an ICU and were up for adoption. So shelters across our area are asking for people to adopt or foster animals to help clear kennels.